Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a requested video, which is first dates, do's, and don'ts. There was a recent article on my website that spread popularity pretty quickly, and I'm basically just going to go over the points that I shared in that article because I think it's pretty true, and anything that you really look up online can really help with this type of stuff. First dates really are not as important as second dates or third dates just because you're really just starting to get to know someone and you really won't know their true selves until you spend a lot of time with them so this is this is just gonna help you settle your nerves if you've never been on a date before or you're really nervous to go out with someone new and you just want some extra tips then just keep on watching because we're gonna go over them footers tip don't be too serious we mistakenly have done this in the past um, even just like with people that I already know and are comfortable around, sometimes I'm just like really serious if it depends on the environment, which brings up another point, point number two. If you have the option to like choose where you're going for your first date, I suggest not doing like a dinner date as your first date, unless you know them a little bit, you know? Just because if you don't know that person at all, then like sitting down and having dinner is just promising like, an hour and a half that you're gonna have to sit with them and if you really just start to notice throughout the date that you just don't really like that person that much then something like going out to get ice cream or grabbing a bite to eat through the drive-thru and then going to the park like you can always like bring up the excuse like I have to do something after this or something like that but with dinner like going to a fancy restaurant that's like something that you do with a couple that has been together for a while or you know that you're working out you know I just think that's a good idea just to go out and do something that's just like quick or fun or something that really you can determine the time with you feel points number three don't bring up past relationships I've had a few people in my life where I'm just not getting to know them it's not even just necessarily on a date but they just brought up their past relationship right off the bat and it's understandable if you guys are just like friends, but if you're wanting to be more than friends with this person, then bringing up past relationships on the first date or even the first couple few dates is not really something that's that classy to do just because you want to respect that other person and you don't want them to already be like, oh my gosh, like, are they comparing me to them? Or, you know, you don't want to bring up those questions in their mind because I'm sure they are curious, but down the road, if you guys really like each other, then you'll be open about that. Number four, be open about whenever they're asking like where you would like to go on your first date or something. Just be down to like, just be flexible because you never really know what can happen. But at the same time, like I said earlier, a dinner date would not be preferable, but if he is really like that type of guy, he's just like really classy and really just wants to take you out on a nice date, then like do it. Like it's only like a few hours of your life. So really, what I just said earlier can go both ways, but if you have the option to choose where you go, then give them a good idea. Jump on it, you know? Jump on it. And number five, dress how you would like to dress. And typically for a date, that means dress up a little bit more than you usually would instead of just a t-shirt or shorts or something like that. Wear a cute romper or something. You don't want to do something like high heels and a dress unless you're going somewhere really, really, really fancy. But I just say be cute but comfortable. And if that's not your style, then be yourself. <laughs> so if you're like a chick that really just loves wearing band tees and stuff like that, and you end up wearing a dress and heels, that is obviously not really reflecting who you really are. So, just kind of find a balance, you know, meet in the middle. Okay, I hope some of these tips help you guys. And if it did, leave a like to this video. And if you have any more tips for people down below, fill the comments with them and create conversation. Because we all love having conversations about boys, don't we? Yes, we do. Okay, I love you guys, and if you would like to watch my last video, you can click right over here. And above my face is a subscribe button. You know the drill. If you would like to click it, you can watch more videos and stuff like that. So, love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Deuces.